The U.S. Forest Service is adding a few new four-legged friends to its ranks. The Forest Service is training two German shepherds to help law enforcement officers as they patrol millions of acres throughout North Idaho and Montana. From our North Idaho newsroom, KXLY 4's Andy Bishop takes us inside the training. Where's that? Where's that? An ounce of marijuana is hidden somewhere inside this Forest Service building. Two-year-old Caliber is on a mission to find it. Come on, find a dope. Find a dope. In less than a minute, he sits down, a sign he's found the drugs. Caliber and Nero train for every scenario an officer with U.S. Forest Service may encounter when out in the woods. A confrontation. Just leave me alone. I said leave me alone. Oh, oh, good boy. To catching a suspect who just won't stop. We have drug gardens, we have issues. We have problems. We have people that are there that have warrants. We run into folks that are hiding. Officer Kayla Jackwith works on the Bitterroot National Forest. Her backup is often hours away. The training emphasizes officer protection for that very reason. They will protect you with everything they've got. It's a very special relationship. Officer Jackwith has worked with canines for a decade. We are his pack, and he is my best friend um, and when we're out there he changes the whole dynamics of a situation for me situations that could be dangerous it makes me feel a little safer because I am out there by myself officer Don Dennison works on the Coeur d'Alene National Forest in the past year alone there have been four homicides on forest land including the murders of Cynthia Buick and Neil Howard near Dobson Pass in the Silver Valley that's a huge number for for homicides on National Forest. We, we've never seen that in previous years. Making the need for Caliber and Nero even greater. I see the crimes going out into the forest and it, you know, it, it bothers me because that's where people like to go, get away from the telephone, the crime, you know, and, and people should feel safe on the National Forest. In North Idaho, Annie Bishop, KXLY4 HD News.